What the hell is going on in there? Hi. Man, can you put this on vlog, please? Bro? Yes. <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from Kazakhstan originally, but... Oh. It sounds like you're just gonna blow someone up. Thank you so much. You're like, send the nuke! If this is what moving on from Disney is meant to be like, then, um... I'm having no part in that. Hello everyone, I'm Alex, and welcome back to another video on Jake Paul. I'm really trying to hit 200,000 subscribers if you can't tell, so we're just gonna be smashing these out until I hit a million views. Actually, this one is important. This is an important video. This isn't just another Jake Paul video. You know, there's actually something to cover in this one of interest. Jake Paul was caught racially abusing a fan. And by caught, I mean, he edited it and uploaded it to his 8 million subscriber YouTube channel. I am losing hope at this point. I'm pretty sure he has to be doing this on purpose. I bet the Disney boys had sat around an office somewhere going, nice mutual decision, boys. We really dodged a bullet with that one. I was saying in a video earlier this week, if you don't go on a racial sl then are you really a full-time social influencer in 2017? Because you're missing the mark if you haven't done that yet. Make a draw my life? Yeah, 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 we could, we could tick that one off. Go on a racial outburst? Yeah, that one's, um, that one's sorted too. I must say, it takes its own form of YouTube genius to expose yourself on your own 30-minute feature-length vlogs. What the hell is going on in there? Hi. Man, can you put this on vlog, please? Bro? Yes. <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from Kazakhstan originally, but... Oh. It sounds like you're just gonna blow someone up. It sounds like... You're just going to blow someone up. Send the nuke! Alright, that, that's enough. Alright, he's taking it a bit too far there. I love it how just after he racially abuses this fan, it just cuts to a clip of him ordering a McDonald's. Send the nuke! May I please have a number one? Haha, <laughs> very funny! Uh, you sound like you're not from here, so you must be a terrorist and nuke people. Can I please have the latest McDonald's Happy Meal? Thank you. May I please have a- Two number nines. I was reading the comments on this video because I wanted to see what the people have to say about Jake Paul and his latest drama. Fuck's sake, this isn't being racist. He's just being a bit of an asshole. Just a bit. People used to term racist way too loosely. Well, to be fair, hearing an accent that is uh, of Middle Eastern descent and going, oh, you're probably a terrorist. You probably want to blow me up. It's ever so slightly racist. If you hear somebody talk and you just go, Oh wow, sounds like he is from the terrorist place. Terrorist land. Tickets now on sale. I'm gonna say that association is ever so slightly biased and therefore may make you at least some form of racist. I think the real lesson to learn here is when you and your gang of hooligans point a camera at yourself all day for 90% of your day, you're bound to say something ever so slightly stupid. And I can cut him some slack there, you know? I, I can excuse that. But what I can't cut slack on is the person who has to cut the videos. Surely you watched it back at least once and went, you know that part when we're going through the drive through and we, we call that a fan a terrorist? Maybe that shouldn't make the vlog today. Maybe I should put in a part where I like set my neighbor's house on fire or something. Maybe we'll just do another one of those. Saying your fan is gonna nuke you is not an improvement on destroying your neighborhoods. Surely the person you hired paid money, exchanged money to edit your videos, could have at least watched that back and gone across his Jake Paul list. Have we burned somebody alive today? Yes, all right, edit that out. Did we accuse our neighbours of killing us? Yes, alright, we should probably edit that one out, that one didn't go down too well. This track, people hated those, take that one out. Racism? That one's not on the list, do we just... Do we just leave that one in? I mean, it pushes the video over 10 minutes, so... It's an extra mid-roll. And in his almost Quebble Cop-like manner, he ends his fuck-up with a trip to McDonald's. I don't think you're just gonna blow someone up. <laughs> you're like, send the nuke! Were you making a prank over there? Yeah, we were. <laughs> oh, can I just take a picture of me? Yeah, let's do it, bro. May I please have a number one? At least we know where Jake Paul's going when his dad's dead. That was really dark. Well, thanks for watching this video. If you guys did enjoy it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. We're trying to hit 
200,000 subscribers by the end of the year, so it'd be cool if you could help me do that. I'm actually feeling a bit hungry, so I'm gonna head off and get myself a, a happy meal, but uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, people. Have a good day.